Hello and welcome back to our English language lesson. In today's session, we will be learning some new vocabulary words and how to use them in different contexts. So let's get started. The first word we will be learning is quintessential. It is an adjective that means representing the most. Perfect or typical example of something. For example, she is the quintessential representation of a strong and independent woman. The word can also be used in a sentence like the Eiffel Tower is the quintessential symbol of Paris. The second word we will be learning is magnanimous. It is an adjective that means generous or forgiving, especially towards a rival or less powerful person. For example, the magnanimous king pardoned the traitor who had tried to overthrow him. Another example of using this word in a sentence could be he was magnanimous in defeat and congratulated his opponent on a well-played game. The third word we will be learning is ubiquitous. It is an adjective that means present, appearing, or found everywhere. For example, in today's world, smartphones have become ubiquitous. Another example of using this word in a sentence could be the smell of Freshly baked bread is ubiquitous in the bakery. The fourth word we will be learning is mellifluous. It is an adjective that means having a pleasant and musical sound. For example, she had a mellifluous voice that was a pleasure to listen to. Another example of using this word in a sentence could be the sound of the waterfall was mellifluous and soothing. That's all for today's vocabulary lesson. I hope you have learned some new words and how to use them in different contexts. Remember to practice using these words in your everyday conversations to improve your English skills. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next lesson.